got another boat going out of here today. This is a 2270 with the hunt deck, which makes it right at 24 feet. It's got a 200 Suzuki on the back of it. Boat runs in the 48 to 50 mile an hour range like you see it now. It's a heavy boat, all 3 16 stick aluminum, solidly decked, which we'll look at in just a moment. But with a big, heavy bow fishing platform up front with around, I think it's got 11 lights in the front. He's got two that he can add on right here in the middle, should he decide to do that, and then two more on the platform in the back back there. So he's got a lot of different setups that he can do with his bow fishing lights, depending on what he's doing that night and, and, and what he's bow fishing for. But this boat is solidly decked. Um, it's got a winch, a 4,500 pound winch. Come take a look up front. Got our through hole winch mount on it. That's all that you see sticking out right there is just the fair lead and the hook. Permanently mounted 4,500 pound winch underneath there with a uh, remote control. The bow fishing deck is removable. It's simply unstrapped with the straps that we have it down and it can come off if you want to convert it to a rod and reel fishing boat. You can do it pretty easily. Uh, but if you look inside here, this is all solidly decked. So you have one, two, three, four compartments that go down inside this deck. And we can do underneath the deck any way that you want. We could have made these individual compartments. He wanted it all open underneath the floor. And it's all hydro turfed underneath there. So anything he drops down inside there has the same hydro turf down inside the boxes. Um, then he's got two long rod lockers on both sides that are dry storage as well. And then you walk to the back, you step down these steps, which are also dry storage boxes as well. And then he's got a big dry storage box here in the middle. Um, it also could be a live well if you wanted it to be a live well. And then in the back, you have your gas tank, power pole pumps, cranking batteries, things like that. He's got a kicker motor that he's got on here that the customer is going to hook up a uh, stick steer set up on the front deck up there eventually. He's going to do that himself. He wanted to do that project himself. So we mounted the kicker for him and ran his controls to the front. But that's how he plans to use the bow fishing platform in the front is to trim up the main motor and then steer with the trolling motor in the back which is a 9.9 .9, uh, Suzuki. So really good setup designed exactly the way that he wanted it i know it looks hot it's black and my goodness is this hot out here i got sweat pouring in my eyes it's straight up august louisiana 115 degree heat index right now but that black this is keep in mind he's using this boat at night most of the time and he wanted it black so we painted it black wanted black turf so we put it black that's how you can get your boat the way that you want it at gator tracks boats so give us a call and thanks for checking this out